Hey guys, in this video I'm going to do a full review of the official Android 5.1.1 Lollipop update uh, for the Google Nexus 9. Uh, this is a new tablet but they didn't uh, update it to the 5.1 version like they have did to previous devices. A lot of devices like Nexus 5, the Nexus 6. Uh, so, I was, uh, I was using this on Android 5.0.1 uh, which was like full of bugs and uh, it, it came with the 5.0.1 right out of the box uh, so we had like a lot of bugs and a lot of apps crashing and st uh, stuff like that uh, but you know the 5.1.1 is a really great update you can't really see any any um, UI changing uh, but you know only this this thing here that we have uh, with the Wi-Fi you can see that we have this cool arrow where you can click and quickly connect to any Wi-Fi connection uh, without going into main settings same with the Bluetooth if there are some Bluetooth devices near you, it will it's going to appear here, and you can just connect to any uh, Bluetooth device that you want to, but uh, without going to into the main settings. So uh, you can see that uh, overall visually it looks like the same, but uh, a lot of things have improved in terms of the performance, um, especially apps opening and uh, and stuff like that. Uh, all in all, a lot of stuff has been improved, speed and everything. So you can see that. Is really responsive. Let's go into some different multiple apps here. You can see it's open up the apps really fast. I haven't seen any crash or anything like that, so it's just real nice. It's gonna go into the main settings. So you increase the brightness, and then also. 5.1.1 version so yeah basically we have the same type of interface let's just go through it as you can see three options uh, settings, widgets and wallpaper um, there's no new wallpaper by the way the same wallpaper that we have and, uh, and you can hold down to any app and you can have it on the home screen and you can also hold down any app and move or you can just remove it from the home screen if you don't like it there um, you can also go into the app info to check out different things you can uninstall the app or disable uh, works really fine then also overall it's really improved and yeah the battery life is also improved I mean uh, I've been using my Nexus 9 for uh, about like um, like almost almost like 15 hours from now. You know, since I installed the upgrade and uh, and then I charged my Nexus 9 to 100 percent, and then I watched some movies and uh, heavy internet surfing, and then a little rest, and then the same thing, and it has still some battery left there. So almost like 15 hours, and yeah, with just Wi-Fi usage, you can guess you get it like almost. Um, you know, uh, above more than a day, but yeah, a battery life is improved. Yeah, the battery life is improved with this 5.1.1 version, and uh, and of course, so far I haven't seen any kind of bug or anything like that. Uh, maybe I can see it, um, you know, with the, when the time will pass. But but at the moment there is no bug. There's nothing like that. So. It's a really nice upgrade, and uh, should you install it, yes, you should install it right away. It will fix a lot of problems, including that a uh, memory leak. So you can see the notification. Um, the multitasking area looks really smooth. So really fast update, definitely worth it. So if you want to know how to install it manually, and then do uh, check out the link in the description down below. And uh, and also if if you are already on 5.0.2 Lollipop or 5.0.1 you can update it via ODA it is uh, you know available almost everywhere so yeah thank you so much for checking out this video as always give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you next one peace out